in the stretch and picking up speed for the Cup 16 consolation. They're off and pacing. Cypress Creek and Umbro Sonic trying moves from the far outside and Track Blaster is one of the fastest away. Down the center of the track is Just Another Poor Boy. Just Another Poor Boy, Track Blaster is going to the top. That's Bayside Hall at the inside third and Umbro Sonic emerges outside from fourth. Union Guy through to be in fifth. Cypress Creek is sixth and parked out into the first turn. Spick and Pan is seventh. Run up the flag, eighth on the outside. As they pass the quarter, Washington VC parked out at the rear of the field. He to the flank of Salinas Hanover, 25 and 2. Blazing opening speed, Track Blaster and Mike Safdick made the front. Bayside Hall plugged in for the pocket trip. Up and moving from third. Here comes Union Guy wanting to take over on the way to the half. Ombro Sonic, a wide trip, is moving with that one. Just another poor boy is on the inside from fifth. Cypress Creek out all the way is a rated sixth on the outside. Run up the flag is seventh with a wide trip. Spick and Pan is third from last with Washington VC. Salinas Hanover was tenth past the half in 54 and 1 and the new leader Union Guy into the far turn leaving Ombro Sonic parked out there track blaster surrendered the lead but sits in the pocket third Bayside Hall right there with the pace on the outside fourth Cypress Creek has cover but overland all the way from fifth that's just another poor boy sixth at the inside there goes Salinas Hanover three wide from the rear of the field he is out around run up the flag then it's back to Spick and Pan in Washington VC Union Guy and Moisea trying to get ground on the field 123 and 1 they pass three quarters union guy through the stretch from a following trick comes Bayside Hall from Mike Lachance up out of the three hole it's Bayside Hall that's going to chase union guy through the stretch union guy and Bayside Hall does he have enough real estate what a finish Bayside Hall and union guy give it to union guy union guy with a workmanlike victory to hold on against Bayside Hall then just another poor boy was looking for third in 150 and three what a thriller it looked from this angle like union guy held off bayside hall and we are back at woodbine welcome back to woodbine union guy the winner of the north america cup consolation owned by john and patricia Shelley, trained by joe holloway and driven for the first time tonight by jack moiseev consolation final with a horse called uh, union guy jack a great stretch drive with michael chance and bayside hall Hey, drew real good, and uh, they went quick the first quarter, and I was able to move and make the front pretty easy. And uh, yeah. no, he felt real strong around the last turn, so I just let him pace on. Um, Mike was coming fast, but he uh, dug right in when he seen him coming. Okay, Jack, we're going to pick it up down the stretch now, and uh, you and uh, Mike were off on your own. Got a bit of a breather in that third quarter after making the front of the half. Holman cooled here. Could you hear Mike's uh, horse coming chump coming at you? I heard his horse, and I heard Mike. You know, Mike was yelling at him pretty good. Uh, and my horse wasn't giving in. His horse was just gaining on me, and uh, my horse saw him through the uh, little holes in his uh, hood. He just dug right in the last couple steps. Okay, Union Guy wins quickly. Jack, tell us about your drive in the next race, the $1 million North America Cup, Royal Flush Hanover. What do you know about the Colts? Uh, and I've seen him race a few times in Maryland's. Uh, he looks like a real nice horse. He can race either way. Uh, this guy, you know, he drew pretty good. We got to see what happens. Jeff Snyder called me at the beginning of the week and asked me to come with him. I was pretty happy about that, going for a million. Okay, Jack Moiseev, the winner of the Constellation with Union Guy. His next drive will be for a million, and it is Royal Flush Hanover. Good luck, Jack. Thank you. Let's go back upstairs to Ken Warkinson. All right, the results are official. Union Guy paying 10 dollars and three forty.